One, two, three, react with Mr. Briggs. Hello, my dear friends. I'm so glad to be back and reacting to the best singer in the world. My favorite artist and probably your favorite artist too, Luis Miguel. I absolutely love this uh, performer. I've been following him for many, many decades. Since I was a little boy, I used to listen to him. And, and today's reaction is very, very special to me. You'll know why in just a second because before i tell you i would like to extend you a warm invitation to subscribe to my channel my name is mr briggs i upload videos reacting to music from all over the world especially reacting to the best performers across the world and today we're going to react to dame by luis miguel now why is this video so dear and special to me this is very special to me because I was there. I was actually present at this concert in 1997 in Santiago, Chile. Um, as I said to you, I grew up listening to Luis Miguel and I flew back to my homeland because I was originally born in Chile a long time ago, but I've been living in Australia for more than 30 years now. But I always loved his music and my dream was to be at one of his concerts and to be able to listen to him live and my goodness that concert blew me away uh, it's engraved in my in my memory and I was at the front I actually saw Luis Miguel I, I was dancing like, like crazy enjoying it it was amazing but anyway without further ado let's react to Dame which means give me in English okay let's see Sorry for the pause. I must have been somewhere around the front, uh, not too far from where he is now. Uh, I gotta say that this song was so energetic. It, it was uh, pure electricity going through everyone's veins. And I knew most of the songs, I, I, I ventured to say 99 of all the songs because I know the intro. But this one tricked me because uh, the intro is a bit different to the um, album version. So I, I wasn't sure what it was. And, and when I realized it was Damn It, my goodness, because that was my favorite song around 1996, 97. It had that soul uh, R&B flavor. And Luis Miguel once again proved to everyone that he can adjust to any type of genre. Uh, this guy is, is gifted in, and not only that, a voice, his voice live. Uh, I don't want to sound repetitive, but I've seen so many singers. Um, uh, I don't want to sound presumptuous, but I've seen some of the most popular singers and bands around the world. And Luis Miguel was the best concert, the best concert by far. Second, probably Paul McCartney, uh, who I also saw. But I gotta say, Luis Miguel killed it absolutely killed it his voice he sang for nearly two hours and and this must have been probably towards the end of the show and his vocal range is the clarity of his voice impeccable uh i gotta see him again i haven't seen him since 1997 but i want to go and see him live once again once this bug this coronavirus goes away but anyway enough of talking for me let's continue enjoying uh luis miguel's music <laughs> Oh, 
Ezra, so good looking, I remember that too. Yeah, I saw him here, he got really close to where we were. Oh, the trumpet. I enjoyed this concert so much and the sound was perfect. Yeah, I think, I think he, he saw me dancing with, with my friend and went with this girl and we were dancing like full on. He did a smile at us. to say um also one thing i was surprised was that um he his eyes were so green and his teeth so wide and he was very very slender uh he's very slender on the video but in, in person um yeah he, 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 he transmitted so much energy and and power on the stage he was uh, that night he was shining, he was radiating energy, he, he was in connection, an absolute connection with the audience. There was tens of thousands of, of people um, in that stadium and everyone was pretty much surrendered at, at his feet, at his performance. People had such a good time and I like this concert so much. I, I'm not going to lie, it was an expensive ticket. Um, I, I bought at the front and... and uh, I like the concert so much that I went back again the, the next night. All right, let's continue watching. It was all worth it though. He said, listen to this. This is a stadium. I think the lights were very bright. So he closed his eyes a bit, like he's used to it. He's always been like that, but remember the lights were so bright. Oh, I love this beat. Best concert I've ever seen. I remember around here he grabs a, a Chilean flag, I think. Because the guy that was about three, three people on my right gave it to him or something. Yeah. That's right. I remember that. Listen to those trumpets. Wow, this brings me back so many memories. Um, this was at, at a stadium called San Carlos de Apoquindo, very close to the Andes Mountains. And uh, it was packed. There were so many people. Uh, I remember one of my friends traveled to Chile uh, the year before to see him in the National Stadium, and she fainted. She had to actually uh, be assisted at the stadium because she was totally in love with Luis Miguel and, and she told me that the concert was so good so I remember when I flew to Santiago in October 1997 I, I went there for three months this concert was sometime around November spectacular um, at the time I was studying at university so I, I didn't have much money and I spent a lot of money because I really wanted to see Luis Miguel. Uh, I remember my auntie said, are you crazy? You're going to spend so much money. And let me tell you, it was worth it. was worth it every penny, every penny, because it was the best concert that I ever seen in my life. 
some some singers are very flashy, you got lots of dancers and especially dancers and especially fakes, blah 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 blah. But Luis Miguel can sing and he's something about his voice that is so you so unique. So Luis Miguel. And uh wow, you know, I enjoyed it so much that I went back the next night and I, I bought another ticket. Um they were sold out, so I was very, very fortunate to to get another one. Uh, and my dream is to be able to see him live again with my family. I want to take my family as well to see him live because, I don't know, guys, if, you've, if you haven't seen Luis Miguel live, I'm sorry to say you're missing out. You have to at least once. You have to go to his concert. It's, it's, a, it's the best experience. Uh, so, this is why Luis Miguel is, is so... Um, professional and he demands his engineers his musicians to give it all you know he doesn't like mistakes and and i know some people you know think that he's very but he does it because he wants to give us quality every dollar that you pay he wants to give you value for your money and his performance is out of this world i like many singers i venture to say um Luis Miguel is up there with Elvis, Michael Jackson. To me, he's even better than them. I like Elvis, I like Michael Jackson, and maybe I'm gonna get a lot of hate for, for, for saying this, but to me, he's the best one. He's the best one. And we gotta treasure uh, artists like him. He's, he's extraordinary. Anyway, guys, boys and girls, thank you so much. Subscribe to my channel, and please request more Luis Miguel music so we can continue reacting to Luis Miguel. Mickey. Bye.